On Sunday, June 23, a church attendee woke up very early to go to Christ Embassy Church in Oregon, Lagos State, Nigeria. When they got close to the church, they saw a huge crowd of onlookers and a few fighting machines. When they got closer, they saw a huge flame of fire engulfing their church premise. Christ Embassy Megachurch in Nigeria is led by Pastor Chris Oyakilom, who has for a long time at war with the world elites due to his stance on COVID and the New World Order. The cause of the fire was yet to be known at the making of this video. Eyewitnesses at the scene captured and shared the unfolding events online. One such user, Augustine, tweeting as Chief Augustine 1, posted a video showing the extent of the fire. He wrote, Christ Embassy Church on Billings Way, Oregon, is on fire. Serious fire is raging, and men of the Lagos State Fire Service are working hard to put it off. Thank God service hadn't commenced fully. No casualties have been reported at the making of this video. Christ Embassy, also known as Love World Incorporated or Believer's Love World, is a megachurch and Christian denomination founded in 1987 by Chris Oyakilom, who hails from Edo State, Nigeria. The church, with its headquarters in Lagos, Nigeria, has since become a global network of churches with congregations in many countries. By 2019, the church had 145 branches on five continents. The church has ministries in Canada, Ghana, Nigeria, South Africa, the United States, and the United Kingdom. The swift response by the fire brigades was able to quench the fire, and they went ahead to have their Sunday service since only a part of the church was destroyed. When Pastor Chris Oyakilom got to the pulpit to deliver his sermon, he told his congregation not to be troubled since they will rebuild their sanctuary bigger and better. When something like this happens, you look at it, what does God think? God just gives us an opportunity to do something about it. That's all. What are we going to do? Okay, great. The house of God. All right, it's been burnt down. Okay, all right. We'll clear out the place, build a better one, a more beautiful one. That's, that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. And let the devil lick his wounds. Yeah, that's it. Because we, we must look at life from the spiritual. This is not what you call an accident. No. Because we are not ordinary people. We are helped all the time. He told us even when, even when you walk, he says, don't worry. You wouldn't even dash your foot against the stone. Why? He said, because he gives his angels charge concerning you. So everything that happens in your life is on plan. There's no accident to the child of God. Indeed, no. that's a powerful exaltation and encouragement to the body of Christ at Christ Embassy Worldwide. To Pastor Man. Chris Oyakilom and the entire congregation. I extend my best wishes and prayers as you embark in rebuilding church building. I quote a friend who shared this words, A house of worship is meant to be a sanctuary, a place of peace and spiritual nourishment. Having that sanctity violated by the destructive force of fire is an immense blow. My heart goes out to all those grappling with the material and emotional toll of this tragedy.